What's up world, it's your boy Julian, and I'm gonna give you an in-depth look how I clean my full workspaces from the barber studio, hallway, bathroom, waiting room, and SMP studio. First off, I sweep all of the hair that's on the floor that's left from haircuts, which makes it way easier for me to wipe down the floors and mat. I finally finished my last haircut for the week, and it's time to start the process of getting all the spaces cleaned and refreshed for the incoming week. Next, I wipe down all of my surfaces to make sure there's no dust or hair particles. I make sure that the floor is spotless with my wet jet vacuum on my mats and floors. I take a lot of pride in taking care of my space. It's really a labor of love. Barbering and SMP are my passions and ensuring that I come in on Monday to a clean space with a clear mind is essential for me to be ready to work. taking the trash out into the hallway so I can collect it out of every room and take it to the dumpster. Gotta make sure that the, the hallways are swept and clean and never know what dirt people track in from outside, keeping them decent condition. I spend a lot of money on them and I make sure they're treated with respect. Headed into my second hair studio to clean, disinfect, and get prepped for the upcoming week. Making sure that my chairs are sanitized with antibacterial spray is very important. I gotta make sure that they're wiped down and ready to go for Monday morning. For a while, uh, this room smelled like burned hair. I'm just now getting the smell out. That's a whole other story for another video. I make sure that this room stays pristine for whenever I need it. hitting this room with the Swiffer wet jet sweeper for the end of the week cleaning. I'll make sure that the bathroom is fresh and sanitized for customers and myself. Probably one of the things that I dislike doing the most, but hey, it's a reflection of my business and you gotta make sure everything is up to high standards. It keeps me humble in a way because these ways times where I wish I had my own space and dreamed of what it would be like. So now I can't really complain about cleaning or keeping up with maintenance or if there's any issues because in all it is really a dream. Scrubbing the sink with disinfectant spray and scrubbing the toilet with Ajax cleaner. These are the things as a business owner that may not be glamorous, but you may not want to do them, but they have to be done. I gotta make sure I take all the trash bags out from every room. I keep pictures of certain clients that I've cut or done SMP work for on my wall, in my waiting room. It shows the progress I've done and that I'm proud of the work I've done so far. It's honestly some of the things that motivates me to keep going and strive to get better at my craft. I really enjoy seeing it when I walk in every time I come to work. Different celebrities from NFL players and rappers to client that I'm really proud of how their SMP hair tattoos have came out or how I saw the happiness in their face when they look in the mirror and see their new permanent hairline. And stuff like that is honestly worth more than money. Just doing a light sweep in the waiting room area with the glass table, some leather couches, chairs, and my refrigerator that I keep stocked with complimentary beverages for customers. I wanted the area to have a nice chill vibe as soon as you walk in. A large smart TV and open area for if you're coming to get a haircut or SMP hair tattoo. On to clean the final room, the SMP studio. Um, the SMP studio is usually in use on Sundays for when I have a hair tattoo session scheduled. 
uh, um, I'm still finishing up the final touches on this space where I'll have my own office and a reception desk. Uh, the grind just doesn't stop at all. Actually, I'm almost done designing this place. And once I get the TV mounted, the TV stand mounted in there, mm -hmm. I feel like a, a reception desk right here in my closet. I'm yeah. gonna remove the door and then put a reception desk there. Then I'm gonna make this room my office. So this room right here will be my office. And then I'll be officially done. With, well, at least with the initial. Uh, yeah. After 40 minutes of cleaning, I am finally done and ready for the upcoming week of work. Just a behind the scenes of what it takes to keep my area running smoothly and be prepared to have a successful week. <laughs>